I have a riddle. What makes working day and night at a fashion magazine all worthwhile? Fame? Nope. Fortune? Nah. -uh. Free, Free samples. samples! Bingo! The style convention had a little something for everyone. Like this briefcase. For the working girl who wants a little more girl in her work. What's in there anyway? Everything you need for a little professional self-pampering. Mascara. Oh, lipstick. Ooh, Angel, you'll like this. As for the briefcase. Sorry, it's all mine. Thanks, cool cat. Mmm, sweet, yet spicy. It's Swicy by Kelvin Kine. And the sales rep said to try it this way. Now walk into it. Even spicier. I don't know whether to flounce or strut. Byron, what are you doing here? Shh, quiet. They're out there. Are you being chased by bad guys again? Of course I am. And as usual, I've eluded them. Unfortunately, I've made a grave mistake. You smell terrible. Precisely. That's the last time I hide in a dustbin outside the sushi factory. Try this. Mmm, swicy. Brilliant idea. Here they come. So anyway, like then I'm all, uh-huh, and he's all, no uh and I'm all, as if, and he's all, whatever. And that's how I got Dad to raise my allowance. Aw, I wish I was good with words. Yeah, well, like, Ew. I think Ugly Creeps Anonymous meets on the first floor. Yeah, and if I wanted the heebie-jeebies, I would have picked some up from the heebie-jeebie store. That's right, go on. Shoo! And like, stay out. Anyway, more allowance is nice, but for, like, the big bucks, look at this. The National Inquisitor is offering a thousand dollars for photos of mysterious phenomen... Phen weird stuff. Like the amazing Beaver Boy. And this microscopic alien spaceship. Well, those things shouldn't be too hard to find. We can take our own pictures. Duh. That's where we're gonna borrow Birdie's camera. Come on, by the end of the day, we'll be rich. There you two are. Verdine, we want to borrow your camera. Excellent, bring it tonight. We might want a record of the proceedings. Don't forget, the secret rendezvous. I'll contact you with a definite time. Whatever you do, don't let anybody know, especially those brats. <laughs> what was that all about? The super top secret thing, remember? A scheme so extraordinary that no one must ever know of it. Who's Mummy Wummy's bestest widow kisser? Mmm, yes you are. Yes you are. It seems those paragons of pink have frightened my pursuers away. That won't last for long. Who's after you? Yeah, and what's in your case? This case contains top secret government property. No, that case contains makeup. It's mine. Oh. Right you are. 
this case contains the results of a 20-year-long scientific research project. Those men are Dravakian agents, and they'll stop at nothing to get their hands on it. Well, now that they know you're in the building, won't it be kind of hard to just walk out with? Yeah, those two chumps will grab it in no time. Yes. Although... It won't matter if it's the wrong case, will it? No! You can't take my case! I just got that! It's all for the good of democracy, Jade. Meanwhile, watch that, keep it safe, and whatever you do, don't open it! Oh, but... Cheerio! Oh, great. So, what do we do with it? I don't know. Leave it there? Yes, unopened. Just like Byron said. Would be interesting to know what's in it. Seems he owes me at least that much. Yeah, well, too bad we'll never know. Yeah, sure. Oh, absolutely. I've got to know! But Byron said... I know, Angel. I heard him too. But think about it. What if Byron took his own briefcase by mistake? Yes! This could be mine! It's our civic duty to be sure he got it right. Go on, Cool Cat, pop it open. Oh, I have a bad feeling about this. It's like that story of Pandora, and she opens her box and all the sorrows get released into the world. What if it's full of sorrows, or tribulations, or bees, or... Perfume? Spice? Huh. 20 years of research. It must be some sweet smelling stuff. Ooh, let's check it out. But guys, oh, it's just a spritz. They'll never even miss it. <laughs> Boy, that's one subtle fragrance. So subtle, it smells like nothing, huh? Huh? Oh my gosh! Jade! Sasha! It doesn't just smell like nothing. It looks like nothing! And so do you! Ah! Where are you? Ow! That's my eye! Your eye? You're just an eye now? Uh, no! I, I... I think the rest of me is here. Where? Right next to you! You can't see me either? No. Jade! Ow! My foot! But what happened to you guys? <gasps> oh my gosh! That spray! It made us invisible! Oh, what if it never wears off? We'll be stuck like this forever! Can you imagine my wedding day? Here comes the bride. We think. Settle down, cool cat. There's gotta be an antidote. Ha! Huh, look! Stealth compound number 56. No antidote. Say what? Well, at least you'll never have to worry about zits again. Ow! That's so not funny. Well, don't take it out on me. I told you not to open that case. Hi, Angel. I'm back from the mall. Yasmin! Did... That cushion just stagger across the room and knock over the sofa? <sighs> Not exactly. <gasps> Two! Bless, Bless you. you! What's going on here? Where'd that sneeze come from? Where are Jade and Sasha? Yeah, about that. What would you think if I told you that they were in this room? But you couldn't see them because they were sort of, kind of, invisible? <laughs> I'd say that's ridiculous. There's no such thing as invisibility. Be. You bet.
better believe it. We are out of sight. You know, Cool Cat, now that we're stuck this way, I'm starting to think maybe it's not all that bad. Yeah, it's kind of fun. And think about it. We have a power that no one else has had in the history of the world. Hm, no sense letting it go to waste. Come on. Uh, guys? Where'd you go? See, Bunny Boo? Two giant pink suckers. So wait! Wait, guys. You cannot prank the Tweevils. Yeah, it's bad enough messing with your friends, pranking your enemies. You're just asking for trouble. Hmm, you're right. And that's exactly why we gotta prank them! Let's go! Keep an eye out for something amazing. <gasps> Look, it's the Yeti! Mr. Baba Zuby with his shirt off. Ew. Like, I thought finding amazing things would be easier. Mm, my eyes are getting bored. Hey, give me that back. I take the pictures. Then why'd you give the camera to me? Uh, I didn't give it to you. You took it. Did not! Mm, camera stealer! Uh, take her backer! <laughs> <laughs> hey! Clapper uh, at her! Uh, ventriloquister! Mother of Pink! You two stop fighting! She started it! I don't care! Now listen up! Here's the time for our super secret meeting! Eight. O'clock, seven seven seven, Flamingo Terrace, apartment Q. Eight o'clock, seven seven seven, Flamingo Terrace, apartment Q. <laughs> Keep it down, you mega mouths! I've been planning this for far too long to have you ruin it now. Don't worry, your secret is safe with us. What secret? Ow! If all goes well, we'll finally be able to enjoy life as it should be. Prim, pink, and free of those awful brats. <laughs> Let's go buy some lip gloss. Great, they're gone. Can you stop fooling around now? Are you kidding? We just got started. They're having a secret meeting. With a devious plan, something big, something worrisome. And we're gonna find out what it is. Ow! I'm okay, I'm all right. Nothing to worry about. Ugh, I can't believe you wasted the whole afternoon waiting in the shoe department. It was the size 15 aisle. Where else is Bigfoot gonna buy shoes? Just because it says monster sale doesn't mean monsters show up. Birdine Maxwell? Like, it's us. There you two are. Good stop, Bunny Boo. Thanks, Cool Cat. Sasha? Hey, guys. We're in the building. What is it? I don't know. It's a sinister place. 
I don't like the looks of it. No communications from here on out or we'll blow our cover. If you don't hear from us soon, the address is 777 Flamingo Terrace, apartment Q. Be careful. Nothing to worry about. Bunny Boo out. Now what do we do? I guess we wait. We wait for what? Uh, Byron! You're back. Not before I led my two Dravakian friends on a wild goose chase, of course, and accidentally dropped my secret briefcase down a sewer drain for them to fetch. <laughs> and uh, speaking of briefcases... Ah, uh, well done, ladies. The International Security Agency is in your debt. If someone had got their hands on the contents of this case, there's no telling what trouble it might have caused. Well, um, actually... Oh, don't tell me. You opened the case? Not us! It was Jade and Sasha. I told them not to, but they did it anyway. And now they're invisible, and first they were freaked, but then they thought it was funny, and now they're spying on some super secret meeting. Spying? What time did they spray themselves with a the formula? I don't know, a little afternoon? But... It's eight o'clock. And so... So the formula only lasts eight hours. Any minute now, they'll become visible. Are you alone? No, we're with each other. Hello, you don't have to push. I didn't push. Ow, why'd you kick me? I didn't kick you. Ow! Well, now I did. All right, we're in. We've got a passion for crashing. Girls, welcome to my apartment. Mother of pink, it looks just like her office. I beg your pardon? Wasn't, Wasn't me. me. Listen up, girls, because tonight is the night we shut out the world and we enact the glorious plan I've prepared for all these weeks. Prepare yourselves. Ultra Pink Twin Power Appreciation Fest! We're twins, and so are you! Tonight is the one night I choose to ignore insipid remarks like that. Oh, thank you, Verdeen. Just don't let it out that I was nice to you. It'll ruin my reputation. All right, sis, get out the foot pumice. Time to scrape each other's calluses while we watch fried green magnolias. <laughs> Not so fast, Bernice. We are the ghosts of design and fashion. Hear our words and tremble. You must abandon the color pink. Embrace earth tones. And another thing you mean. Oh. Girls, we're starting things off with a makeover. No, 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 no! Ah! Apartment Q, here it is. Open up! No telling what's happened by now. Step aside, I'll pick the lock. Hey. 
blinked. You poor dear girls. Bye, girls. Like, have a nice evening. Thank you so much for dropping by. Finally, I've gotten the upper hand on those measly, meddlesome brats. <laughs> and we finally got a truly amazing picture. <laughs> Looks like joke is on the brats' girls, eh? Moral to story is, don't spy. Not unless you're professional, like us. <laughs> <laughs>